Good day, good day, good day, everybody. Brian here from Quantlabs.net. Today is August 31st, so I thought I'd do a summary of crypto for the month because we can now do that. And I uh, just wanted to show you, crypto's not been doing good. Earlier part of the month, it did outperform, and then it had a nice negative for the last week or so. It just dropped everything. So here in yellow, we have our standard uh, benchmark, S&P 500. The um, trading basket here for the so-called strategy blue is our um, crypto set of ETFs. Now, as you can see, it, it did have a nice upswing and then started to drift back over the last few weeks. Um, the sharp ratio has gone negative. Not good. Uh, Crypto is just something you gotta really stay away from if you're just quote unquote investing or buying and holding or hodling or whatever. And I just think there's obviously better performers out there. This is the total year, uh, for the last year, the crypto with monthly returns. You can see we only had two positive months, just more downward pressure on the whole asset class. But here for August, uh, where it's really dicey, it was up in the first two weeks up about 20 some odd percent um, and it's gone negative again to negative five for the whole month this is how volatile crypto is prior month 144 month percent but just to, to try to get this kind of monthly return is not really worth pursuing so I'm going to show you some of the ETFs that I focus on or trust or whatever uh, for uh, crypto so Here's the overall metrics I just showed you, um, but namely, these are the asset, assets that I have access to within, um, within interactive brokers. <clears throat> Some of them are mining ETFs or just infrastructure, but the only one that's positive and barely positive is this one right here. This is the Grayscale Ethereum Classic. So you can see here, that's the only positive one. Everything else is negative. So again, it's a very weak asset class. Don't recommend it at this point. Um, yeah, it will come back. And when it does, I think it'll come back, hopefully with a vengeance. It's got to clear the regulation and the likes like uh, Bitcoin and Ethereum will go mainstream and will be accepted by the mainstream and, and there will be confidence from the mainstream uh, investors because it's gone through that regulation process. I'm not happy to say that, but because of the yahoos out there that have destroyed the concept of of uh, uh, crypto, uh, it's totally shaken a lot of people's confidence in it. Um, I can tell you uh, with the fees in the call it fiat world, legacy world, I despise. But crypt trading crypto was a great uh, opportunity because there's very little commission fees. But now, here we are. Uh, it's heavily regulated to death. Um, and again, the only one that's profitable is barely profitable is this ETCG uh, which is Grayscale Ethereum Classic. Alright so if you want to know more about this and what I plan to do or just get some alerts or whatever uh, come over to quantlabs.net slash books fill in your info uh, keep it, we keep your info private and uh, yeah and then you get some emails from me and we'll leave it at that. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.